Jason, a 3-2 battle. Unfortunate result. Overall thoughts on that game? Overall, pleased with the first half. Second half, uh, we had a 15-20 minute stretch where we stopped passing the ball. Um, and that allowed the opposition to, to really get uh, control of the game. Um, you know, it's, it's a little bit disheartening where the second time we've played them where we've conceded a goal, the first goal, and then all of a sudden two or three pop in in a short period of time. Uh, we needed some leaders on the park, somebody to grab the game by the scruff of the neck, get us passing the ball again because fair play to uh, Louisville. They sensed blood once they got one and they just went after it over a period of 20 minutes to get themselves back in the game. You know, we, we fought it till the end, uh, snuck one back in to bring it 3-2. Um, but in the end, it was that 15, 20 minute spell after halftime uh, that it was our undoing. And going forward, how do you kind of put this behind you and kind of take away some of the things you just said to go forward and make it a positive? That's that sort of professionalism, you know, approaching the games and knowing that uh, if, even if you had a successful period during the first half, you need to continue to do what was working. Um, we stopped getting the ball to Marcos Nunez, who was a threat in the first half. And, uh, amongst other things, you know, we need to be better with the ball so that we're not just chasing constantly uh, for pretty much the second half. Um, hopefully the players can take, take some of those things away and improve the next time we play. Um, but it's the mental side of the game that let us down today. And a positive thing you can take away is you scored more than one goal, and that seems to be coming more of a consistent thing. Is this something you guys will be working on practice and trying to keep doing as you go on? Yes, I, I think we can take some confidence from uh, scoring two goals. Uh, usually when you score two goals at home, you, you should get a result. Um, so we have to move forward from that side of things. Um, but definitely uh, the attack and play in the first half was, uh, was something positive and something we can take forward from it. The last time you faced Louisville, they scored three goals in the, in the first half and they scored three goals in the second half today. Do you think it's the overall pressure that they bring into games is why they're such a good team? I think they're well drilled, they're well coached. Um, you could sense that they sensed the blood as soon as they got one back. And then from there, it was they just kept pressurizing. Um, and unless you can keep the ball and play through their pressure, then you're just inviting uh, more uh, sort of defensive pressure onto yourselves. So, um, you know, give them credit where credit's due. Uh, you know, they hunted the ball, they went after it, they were aggressive. Uh, we gave up the ball in some bad areas and they were able to capitalize. So, uh, you know, it's, it's no shock that they're where they are to the top top half of the league. Um, it's not for by coincidence. And you think it's a positive to also take out Fondi, who scored the brace against you guys last time, and this is the third leading scorer in the league. Do you think it's a, a good, po a positive thing to have uh, their top scorer not be on the score sheet tonight? Yeah, we addressed him for the most part. Sometimes he gave us some difficulty, uh, especially in the second half. But, you know, he was a, a quiet contributor where he was linking the play and bringing others into the game. So. And the way they play, if, they, if he has that type of game, then other players can, can be involved and be dangerous, which is what you saw. So just because he wasn't on the score sheet doesn't mean he wasn't effective. And Babouli scored his first goal in uh, quite a while, actually. Are you proud of him to score his first goal? Yes, it was a good goal. He took it well. And Jordan Hamilton, too. Yes, uh, I think their keeper probably could have done better, but a goal is a goal. Um, and hopefully that will do him some good.